Good morning everyone, welcome to my channel Makeup and Hair Company. This is Nivedita. I'm a hair and makeup artist here in Virginia. Today is a beautiful sunny day here in uh, Virginia and uh, I'm having a bridal trials with um, an American today. So basically I do, uh, I've been doing a lot of uh, Indian uh, bridals and Indian bridal parties uh, but um, Today, after a very long time, I'm going to have uh, an American Bridal Trials. Today, I'm super excited for it and uh, I'm just going to walk you through how I set things up in my home studio. So what you see behind is my home studio. So um, with a lot of plants, of course, because I'm super obsessed with plants. So let's get into the video. I just want to show you guys uh, this apron that I got it customized from Amazon so this is basically a hairdresser's apron which says um, the name of my company which is makeup and hair company and um, it has um, it can be separated like this it has this uh, zipper here and also it has uh, two pockets and two side pockets so which is actually very convenient although it's a little heavy I've used it a couple of times and uh, I, I find this useful especially to keep my phone uh, you know when we have uh, larger bridal parties we have to keep finishing clean the brushes and then come back to the next person so I end up searching uh, for my phone every single time but I used to put it in this pocket and uh, I used to keep some hairsprays and um, uh, combs and clips always in this pocket because it's very handy and um, because every single time you know the most uh, common item that you use in um, hair uh, too is uh, your hairspray which is your light hairspray so um, I always tend to keep that in this pocket so it's, it's a bit of practice but it is very very handy uh, for the upcoming or budding makeup artist or hairstylist I definitely recommend buying one of these with your company's logo um, it's definitely worth the buy So this is where I have set my hair station. So I have a power cord where I've connected my um, tongs and barrels and my crimper. And um, I sometimes I use this uh, wand especially to curl the uh, front pieces which frames the face. So uh, I have my comb set up. That's my magnet, uh, bobby pin magnet. And I have all the hairsprays and hair uh, stuff here. The hair wax is also ready. Sometimes, you know, because of the winter weather, uh, actually put this in the microwave, throw this in the microwave for uh, 10 seconds, just warm it up a bit, especially in winter weather, it solidifies uh, very hard and um, it gives a hard time. So just try to put it in the microwave and you're good to go. So here uh, on this side of the desk, I have placed my bobby pins and uh, here is my trash bin and uh, this is the hair kit. The rest of the stuff is all tucked here and neatly organized because this way, you know, it's much more easier rather than just uh, packing everything in separate uh, cases and, uh, you know, it's, it's, not, it's not a very efficient way. This one um, is very efficient. I will do a separate kit tour um, in the coming days. So this is my brush bag. I have exclusively bought this bag for uh, keeping my brushes and stuff and other tools like scissors and spatulas and um, things like that. So here is where I have set my um, makeup uh, kit and uh, here is the palette and uh, the spatulas and my business cards 
and a brush holder like sometimes you know when I'm um, using a brush from this brush bag I can't put it back because of the sa sanitation purposes uh, so I just put all the dirty brushes here and the brushes that I'm working here uh, so it's easy for me to clean and uh, proceed so I use this uh, chair which is always there in my studio and I just noticed that I have to take take the trash out um, so um, yeah so this is the chair that I use especially for doing hair I feel this um, height is comfortable because I can you know just look at the top of the head take the partition and then it's much more convenient that way but I also have a makeup chair so this makeup chair I just when once when I start uh, with makeup I switch to this chair so that uh, I don't get uh, back pain and I place the mirror right in front of the client so that um, they can actually go ahead and see or make changes and see how the progress is so I always keep a mirror right in front of them Last but not the least, especially in, in my studio when I keep talking to the clients, when we, especially when we are doing trials, it's going to take a long time. So I make sure that I'm well hydrated and I always have uh, water uh, filled up and uh, finish my morning workout and um, get the shower, get ready for the job and uh, yeah, I'll come back. So I'm completely ready and the bride just texted me that she's on the way so I'm waiting for her and I'm just doing some admin work for my company and uh, I'm just chilling until the bride comes.
<laughs> hey Aline, how, how did you like the makeup? Looks amazing. Hair? Thank you, thank you so much. The moment she...